Uh, all that effort I put in is always wasted. Alright. See, now I have to find my own video and it's all. Um, Alright, here and here and then here. No, I'll go here. Please let me know if this stream quality is any better. Sorry about this hassle. Is it going to work? Please let me know if it works. Mm. Close this. And then close that. Here. And it here. A lot of things to click. Ugh. Still not great, yeah. I don't know why this is. This is very disappointing. I'm on Telstra, I thought I, I thought I had this. And now you're telling me Hmm. Yeah, the frames per second is dreadful, and I don't think anyone can even hear what I say because it's so choppy. I'm just trying to think of a way I could uh, increase my internet speed. Um, hmm. Because it's um. So it sounds okay, but um, yeah, I know. But the thing is, this bloody YouTube app has no settings to change. If it had settings to change where it was like, oh, lower the quality or lower the frames per second, but it's like, no, nah, you must stream at like 1080p, you know, um, or whatever. It just tries to put the max output and it just doesn't work at all. Well. Uh, maybe I can... Uh, hmm... Tried so hard here. Um, I'll be back, I suppose. I might just leave the stream going and um, let me know because it seems to be just freezing every couple of seconds. So, just let me know. Well, I mean, you won't actually be able to tell very well if it's actually freezing every couple seconds, but I just assume it's not, you know, it's just really bad. Well, it's better, isn't it? Shit, it hasn't frozen at all. You could always tape down a bit of the camera so it wouldn't be so hard to look at <laughs> I like the thought actually, but I don't think it'll focus very well either. Um, so, oh, it's just going up and down. Alright, might move the thing closer. I'll be back. Two seconds. You need a light. Hey, alright, we're like, how long are we into this? 
I'm like 20 minutes in and I haven't even started yet. Um, all right, we're gonna try that. So I'm just gonna restart this because I can't see the comments on the front of the phone very well. Yeah, how is it? Still awful. Saw someone in the background, yeah. Creepy. I don't want to come, like, review the footage and I see some, like, fucking Slender Man shit over there. Um, how are we, how are we feeling? Discord. But I can't, I can't use Discord on my phone at the same time as videoing on my phone. And I don't think this laptop has Discord. So, um, do you, do you want me in voice chat? Is that what you want? Voice chat in Discord? Because I went on Discord before and didn't even seem like anyone was there. You want me in voice chat or something? Alright. <clears throat> Consider using the lower bit, right? I think it's alright now. What do people think? Is it is it is it okay for people? Shall we just do some chemistry? Join Discord. Alright. But if the internet crashes when I upload Discord, it'd be bloody your fault, alright? Um Alright, we should talk about the chemistry we're doing today. If, because I think it's stable enough, and, um, yeah, everyone's like, please, just, I didn't come here to fucking watch you try and fix IT problems, we came here to fucking see you do chemistry. Alright, I'll close all that, uh, I'll get the internet here going. Um, today we're going to be trying to make ferrates, which is high oxidation state, iron, so it's iron 6, iron 6, iron 6. Um, which is really cool, and ferrates are, um, yeah, they're not very stable, so, so while they're possibly quite strong oxidizers, um, they tend to not find much use at all because um, they are not stable in acidic solution at all, very quickly break down, um, and even just in air, and uh, well, water in the air tends to break them down, so they don't really find much use in the sense of, in a normal synthetic lab, um, they will just um, break down. So, um, but I, I'm interested in uh, trying to get them to, like, do some reactions, possibly. So if we make some, then at least we can play with them and see if it works or not. Uh, what about a ferret? No, not ferrets. F f Ferrate. You got it. it wouldn't be explosion five video unless you were paying out my pronunciation. Pronunciation. Um. Um. Yep. Okay. Hello. Now, um, there are two ways to make ferrets. Uh. Sorry. Get distracted by my own image over there. So that. So that's the computer over there. And there's like 20 seconds of lag. And I, I think it's frozen, but then it isn't. And it's all very distracting. Um, there's two ways to make them. And if we have time, then perhaps we might be able to get through. Well, okay, there's lots of ways to make them. But two kind of obvious ways of making them. Um, one of them is using bleach. And one of them is using fire and potassium nitrate. Um, I have both of those <laughs> chemicals. Um, but so I'm hoping to, maybe we'll get through both of them, but, um, but for starters, this here, so usually when a chemist says liquid chlorine, they mean like liquid chlorine, but, um, this is hypochlorite bleach, sorry, mosquitoes, could have, 
Uh, got to kill as many as I can tonight. There's quite a lot of them. Um, so when I, then when this is sold to me, it was 12.5% hypochlorite. Um, that was, oh, fuck me, probably about a year ago. So it's probably a lot less than fucking 12.5%. I can't even get the lid open. So um, there's a lot of it. Well, probably half full. Oh, uh, maybe less. So there's probably five or so litres of this bleach of unknown concentration. So I'm keen to use this. I think would be good to make some ferrates with. Um, I wish it was a bit more concentrated, but can't have bloody everything. Um, yeah, thank God it's not actually liquid chlorine. If they sold 15 litres of liquid chlorine to me for like, how much was this? 10, 15 bucks. Um, plus, I think fifteen dollars deposit on the container, which is fine. I think that's a good. That was actually a real good deal. Um, yeah, I'd be worried if it was actually liquid chlorine, but hypochlorite just as useful. Um, all right. So I think the stream stable. Is the stream stable? Boop, 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 boop. I think so. I guess low quality, but like, it's okay. Sorry, I um, had the other video and then, you know, you get the notification for that video, but you can't come back and blah, blah, blah. Um, I haven't worked out any of the stoichiometry yet. So if someone wants to maybe do that at some point, should we do that? We probably should have. I should probably should have done that. So, I have all the ingredients, I'm fairly sure. It's just a matter of, um, I can mixing them, I think. Let's take a bit of a tour. Also, um, new news. Look at that beautiful creation in the corner. Hell yeah. That is an E-sized oxygen cylinder. Oh, that was very loud. But yes, beautiful stuff. Um, maybe it's empty now. Maybe I just released all of it. But um, yes, very, very happy. Um, that was probably irresponsible. Anyway, all right. We've got our irresponsible thing on the stream out early. So we'll continue on. We'll just read some comments. Um, yeah, so. Um, yeah, it is for the ozone generator and for other things. I suppose I've got it for an unlimited period of time. I'm not actually having to pay rental on the cylinder. So if you've come across any reactions that particularly use ozone, It'd be great to do some liquid ozone too. Uh, not liquid ozone. Liquid ozone is a bad idea. Liquid ozone. Um, but uh, liquid oxygen would be really cool. All right. Where are we going? Somewhere up the back here. F2 cylinder. Would if I could, mate. Would if I bloody could. Um, I could also get an argon cylinder and an acetylene cylinder um, in the same size. Um, it's just that they cost a bit of money, but that should be fine. Does this light work? Nope. Okay, what do we need? Who's doing the sights for me here? Um, fucking iron something. Yeah? We need iron oxide. Can iron oxide work? Let's have a look. Unless anyone has a different idea of um, calcium carbide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do have some calcium carbide, but also having a tank full of acetylene is just like a next level kind of thing because it's like pure good acetylene. So if you want to do some actual really complicated stuff with it, it kind of removes the level of complexity. Um, for example, there's this reaction that I've always thought about doing, but it seems a little suicidal. It's where you get a set, um, which is well, well above the flash point of acetylene. Um, so it needs to kind of be in, in an atmosphere. And it's basically the boiling point of the sulfur, carbon disulfide, which is a very, very flammable material. But um, if you do it really well and, other, and nothing explodes, 
it's a way of generating lots of carbon disulfide from acetylene, which you have a whole tank of, and sulfur, which costs basically nothing. Um, and so that would be a really interesting way to get carbon disulfide. But I just I haven't grown the bowls to try it yet because it just seems fucking crazy. Maybe I had argon and thought about it. Oh, it froze while I'm in the middle of a big story. Mate, fix the string. Why am I the string? again all right well I can I tried probably heard none of that story that's all right that's what I get for rant, ranting on about something and then um <laughs> and then it gets distracted all right let's have a look in here what do we want that is looking fucking yellow as I should do something about that that is not good have a look at that. Sorry, I've just noticed this. This is a good safety demonstration. Have a look at how yellow. Does anyone want to tell me what this is and why I don't enjoy the fact that it's bright yellow? Oh, you can't even see it well. How do I place this light? Yeah, yellow is bad. Fuck all yellow chemistry. So I should do something about that. That's so yellow. Woo, man. Oh boy, um, that's, I mean, most of you would have guessed by now, but that's potassium metal and yellow means it's forming superoxides. The sodium seems okay, not the greatest, but that's okay. But God, that potassium. Fuck me, that's so yellow. Oh, that's a hazard. That is a hazard. Um, what do we need? Iron, 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 iron. Um, this is iron oxide, that's iron oxide. Um, what's in here? Oh no, don't worry about that. Um, do I have any iron salts? Iron, iron, iron. Ooh, crystals. Iron. Bromide, no, acetate, cobalt, nickel, magnesium, um, it's more nickel, no, none of it, alright, uh, we'll go with this one, this one seems a bit nicer, alright. Um, Alright, gayest person on YouTube, thanks for tuning in. Um, yeah. Oh, that's that's a train by the way as well. Yeah. Alright, ah, oh, shit, we need, we need more chemicals than this. What are we going about? Um, I'm just going to check out. Alright. Um, we need, oh shit. Fuck. Fuck. Come on. Get through the doorway. Alright, fucking. Here we go. So, we're trying to make, trying to do some chemistry. If anyone has some other chemistry that they want me to do, <laughs> see, because I'm not really that prepared for this chemistry, I could actually do anything else. So, if you see some other chemical that you're like, wow, that seems cool, then, um, Maybe, what the fuck is that? Ah! Have a look at this. That's an iodine. 
definitely doing a leak in there. Whoa, look how yellow that, that used to be some white paper towel. Once again, yellow chemistry. Things have gone yellow, it means it's bad. Oh uh, no, it goes oxidizer. Oxidizers, oxidizers. All right, um, barium nitrate. That's what we need. Barium nitrate, 500 grams, beautiful. What else do we need? Is that it? Um, hydroxide. Yeah, should probably use some hydroxide. Is that some hydroxide? Yeah. Yeah, it seems alright. I think so. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. DATV. Um. <laughs> We're not making TATP, sorry. Um, uh, well, yeah, no. Um, <laughs> yeah, what else we got? I really should clean out this cupboard. I've been meaning to um, change this around because uh, it's just getting too full. And that's because my uh, oxidizer shelf is just so full of bloody chemicals these days. Um, Silver nitrate, no, 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 no. Sulfate, no. Um, what else is there? Ammonium perchlorate, nice. Hydrogen sulfate, nice. I'm just, this is just flexing at this point. Um, chlorate, oh, nitrate. Potassium nitrate, oh. Well, that's no good. Oh no. No. Weird flex, yeah, no, it's, it's, it is a weird flex, but I'm, I'm glad you're saying okay. Um, so, the nitrate bucket is empty. You know what this means? This means we get to go on a field trip. Hell yeah, to refill the bucket from the fucking nitrate dispensary. That's what we get to do. I'm excited. If it wasn't midnight, that would be a lot easier. But now it is midnight. It's actually nearly 1 a.m. So, um, yes, late night trip to the nitrate dispensary. What else do you do with your time? All right, oh, so you also have steel wool here. So, it's here, but there's only eight grams, so should be all right. We'll try and get as much as out as we can with that. So, have we worked out what we're doing yet? <laughs> Got all the chemicals. Has anyone worked out how I should mix them or something like that? Could put some gloves on, starting point. Um, I'll put this over here. Cool, cool. Dissolve it before it. So, yeah, watching me buddy hobble around. Oh. Hi, Road Night, by the way. Good to see you. Hello to everyone. Thanks for tuning in. Sorry there was a bit of a false start there, but it seems like the stream has settled down. So, it, it appears that there was no particular reason for my internet to be bad at that particular point, but we fixed it. So, that's good, I suppose. Um, now the big question is, people who are better at chemistry than I am, which is possibly all of you in the chat here, um, do I need to dissolve the iron oxide up before I add it to the bleach? Because as far as I understand it, it'll go into like iron chloride or iron nitrate, and then I'll put it in the basic solution and it's just going to precipitate iron hydroxide. Um, so, but can I just skip that and just put iron hydroxide in? You know what I mean? Or is iron hydroxide fundamentally so much different than um, iron hydroxide? 
Um, let's get some bleach out. Let's get some bleach out. Oh shit, we haven't done the playlist. We should do the playlist. Just when I was about to do some chemistry. While we're actually debating um, what we need. Yeah, yeah, you're saying yeah, iron hydroxide works, but do I need to actually make the iron hydroxide or can I just skip that step and use iron oxide directly in bleach? Like if I mix iron oxide and bleach together, does that make ferrates? I suppose we can just find out. Dab. Fuck. What do you think I am? Come on, man. Um, I'm just ignoring that aggressively. Um, in the video description, there should be a link to something or other. And now I'm going to find my own link here. Um, hopefully this doesn't bring the internet down. Wow, this quality is dreadful. Anyway, uh, it reacts slowly with everything. Yeah. Damn, damn, fuck. All right, well, I'll get this link. Dab on these. You're fucking being my haters and you're, you're dabbing on it, on me. Um. So, I might just, do you see how you can vote on upcoming videos? So, if you click on the link on the description, you get to this room, and um, I can control the music, but you guys control the, um, the, uh, what's the thing? Um, the playlist. What am I doing? So, I'm just thinking about dabbing. Um... Watch me type in my password. That was smart of me. Um, don't hack all my. No, nah, it's not. Um. All right. So I think I can pause it, and then people can upvote what the upcoming videos are. Right. So you search for them, and then paste them in. And let me know if it actually works. And then um, uh, later on, I will uh, get this thing going. Know what I mean? Fuck yeah. Dab for those two dollars. Double down. D I don't even know what that currency is. Dab and, and make, a, make a first soda? What the fuck? Here, we're here to do chemistry, right? Stop getting fucking distracted, alright? Fuck me sideways. Um... Fuck. All right, that there, that there, that there. We need some bleach. All right, we need to get this on because if it's going to take it slow, then we're going to fucking run out of time. Uh, where the fuck do I fuck? Um, oh, I'm stressed now. Fuck. Just, just, just thinking about my first owner. Um, <laughs> this could be Discord emote. Fuck. <laughs> Everything I do becomes a fucking Discord emote. All right, all right, gonna chill the anger um, because we're dealing with a lot of bleach and I don't want to ruin all of my clothes um, as much as you great yield on the dabs. Yeah, 400 for a dab. I don't even know what the currency is. There could be a lot of money. Don't give me a lot of money. Um, you know, I'll probably blow it all in a fursuit. Um, uh, how do I pour this? How do I pour this properly? Let's get the live action shot of me by spilling all this fucking bleach everywhere. How much do we need? What do you reckon? Um, it's Hungarian. Hungarian for is basically worth nothing. Oh, hey. Hungary is worth... Hung, Hungary? Hung, hung, Hungary. No, it's Hung... I can't even pronounce your country's name, but it means a lot to me. It means a lot. <laughs> Let's try and pour this bleach. Surely it's a... They've made it hard to pour. I think I've done that on purpose because you're not meant to pour it into beakers. You're meant to be pouring it into a swimming pool. So, I think they intentionally make it bad. I might just put down some foil because otherwise I might ruin this whole bench top. Foolproof. Foolproof. Look it up online and it seems iron 3 hydroxide should work. Alright. Run of the mill. 
<laughs> um, all right. Pretty yellow. Can't be that weak if it's looking that yellow. Bab. Fuck it. Dance, monkey. Dance. Fuck it. Alright. That's cool. That's good. That's good. Um, now, as far as I'm aware, we'll probably have to add a lot of base to this, right? To buy a new. Um. Yellow can bad, yeah. The more yellow it is, I'm not gonna get high yields. As soon as anything in the reaction is yellow, it means my yields are, you know, 30% or lower. Um, rather watch the chemistry, yeah. I, um, I understand. Um, <laughs> let's, let's get some music going though. I should probably just do that very quickly. That shouldn't be too hard to do. That, 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 that. And then that goes into this one's thing. Ooh, output over here. Breaking down. What are you even doing? Oh, so I'm making ferrates, which is high oxidation state iron. Um, so we've got bleach, we've got iron oxide, and that's about as far as we've got with about an hour's work. So, um, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Um, all star, hell yeah. Uh, so I've got to turn that on, I'm going to turn this on, no, not like that, this, not like that. Actually, I should get the iron oxide dissolving in that. No, base, I should get it cooling down. I think I should cool this down. Let's get an ice bath going. I'm jumping all over the place, but I can't even blame it on the stream. This is how I live my normal life. Um, let's... That wasn't a dab, I was chewing away a fly. All right, that one here, that one here, and then I'm gonna go get a whole lot of ice. I'll be back in um, a couple of seconds. Don't go anywhere. Rude standstop. Well, we gotta vote for it in the room, and then I'll, it might get on the playlist. Hello, hello. What mischief do you get up to in there while well, it's gone? What do you want a bunch of iron three ferrate? Maybe. I'm gonna thermite with it. I want to do that. Did that in the wrong order? That goes in here first, and then I've The water, this is just an empty thing. Now, stir bar. Let's see, if I got an actual clean stir bar here, yeah, that'll be good enough. That one there should be fine. Sue Ephedrine. Drunk a litre of ammonium hydroxide. That's that's a nightmare for me. That's fucking, that's awful. Um, what was I getting? I can't remember what I was, oh, thermometer. Thermometer. 
Um, fuck. This one is zero to two hundred. Do I have a zero one hundred? Nah. Nah. Oh, I should, should use my thermal couple for this. That would be much better. This one here. Oh, if I can have broke it. Oh, I'm a mess. This is. This is so much more organised than a regular extraction design video. You just see it live. Um, all right, that one here. So that has to go. No, that won't survive. Will it? Probably won't. Uh, see, okay. So what the current predicament is, um, this thermocouple usually goes into this glass thing, but um, I currently broke the end. I think I did that in a recent video. So I'm gonna have to flame seal it shut again. So, crack out some fire. Uh, do my risk assessments. Assessments. I think it's sealed. Why don't that cool down anyway? Um, and then that one goes back on the shelf. That can go off. Um, this is my glass. It has shirtless Putin on it for no particular reason. Um, add the iron hydroxide to water first and then add a small amount of sodium hydroxide to get the conversion of hydroxide kick started. Why do I need to kick start the hydroxide? Maybe if I... Uh, do you think... Because you, why? You think it's just going to be slow? Otherwise it's going to be quite slow. Yep, alright. You're, you're not wrong. Uh, well, I'm not wrong. Um, uh, well, why are we cooling that down then? Alright. Um, we'll let that go and... I'll get another beaker. We're going to follow Matt Hunter's advice here on the chat, which is add iron hydroxide to um, the concentrate thing. We should measure the iron hydroxide amount, because otherwise I can't determine how bad my yields are afterwards. Uh, what the fuck are you doing? You should try it small scale first. Ah, yeah, but... Music. Oh, fuck. Music. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Sorry. Sorry. 48 people. Holy shit. All right. Let's get this on. Um, that's on. Why isn't that on? That should be on. That is on. Now... Uh, that's the radio. No, no, no. Yes. Is that it? Oh, it's myself coming through? Okay. Oh, this is... <laughs> Thank you for voting this up. Um... <laughs> this is exactly what I was worried about. Um, I'll, I'll turn up the volume when it's not the USSR next. Okay, fuck it, we'll turn them up. Turn it down here and turn it off on my computer because that's a safer thing to do. Thank you. This is exactly the backing music that I wanted. How's the levels? That should be alright. 
Um, all right. Iron oxide levels, right? Is that where we're at? Um, yeah, 20 seconds. Yeah, well, the last stream, I got like three or four copyright strikes, but that doesn't mean anything. If you get over three or something like that, it means that no one gets any money, but the video doesn't get taken down. I just don't make any ad revenue out of that. So what I got from that was I, copyright strikes are okay as long as I get more than three. So we need at least three. Um, oh no. Alright. This is, I'm feeling very patriotic. Our chemistry. <laughs> um, what's the chemistry? What are we doing? Uh, small scale first. Fuck it, no. Just use, I don't have iron chloride. Uh, it doesn't work like that. Alright, we've got disagreement. Um, This is hard to work. Um, I, okay. I'm gonna add hydroxide to this, I reckon. <laughs> How many verses does this have? This is like the second verse of the Australian National Anthem that no one even, no one knows. And they only play it like official ceremonies and everyone's like, oh fuck, what are the words? This is a banger though, this is, I mean, you know, I don't really get the words, but I get the vibe, you know? Um, yeah, so, alright, uh, that goes in there, and hopefully it's airtight, yes, good, and I didn't even check that before dumping it in the bleach. Alright, it's still 15 degrees, I'll turn it down slightly. Good vodka vibes. What's the, be we should try and find, what's the, if you're going to have a vote for songs, What's the best national anthem song? Like the the one that's like song wise is the best. Because the Australian one, you know, it's okay. It's like very run of the mill, I suppose. So um, this <laughs> sounds like Sandstorm, but I don't know which version. So um. I do want it to be colder, but I don't have that much ice. Yeah. Soviet, yeah, yeah. Can we actually beat um, the Soviet national anthem? I don't know. You know, Congo. Well, add it to the playlist and we can vote Syrian Army. No, let's... <laughs> we're not trying to get political here. We're just, we're just song judging. Okay. Uh, Chemistry-wise, that's getting colder. Um, so... We've got 800 mils of bleach. How much hydroxide should we use? Um, oh, sorry. Not hydroxide. How much iron oxide are we going to be using? That's a, that's a key question. Dutch Anthem? Okay, it's based on a British drinking song. Oh, I love it. Um, um, Alright, um, so ideally you want to add hydroxide to that, but I just feel it's going to be a little slow. So it might, we'll let that cool down for a little bit longer. Um, let's say, okay, what's happening to the song? Oh, uh, undertone. Uh, getting just 
extracted here. Uh, how many grams do we decide? Five gallons. Oh, calcium hypochlorite. Yeah, but uh, there was a problem with calcium hypochlorite. I couldn't remember what it was. Um, five grams? Ten grams? That's five grams. That's five and a half. One kilo, yeah. I don't know. Uh, is the stream dead? Yeah. Sorry, I think the stream's back. Hello. Yeah, there's no, there's no iron chloride. So I could convert it, I suppose. Um, but, um, I don't think we need to, do we? We're going to try it my way, and it's not going to work, but that's science, isn't it? Um, seven grams. Was it seven? Let's go seven. Eight grams, eight grams, eight grams. I pulled that number from fucking thin air. All right. Um, now, hydroxide. Uh, where is it? Here. I should measure the amount, but I'm not going to. Oh! <laughs> what a banger! <laughs> See, it's so weird, because I feel less patriotic listening to this than the USSR National Anthem, you know? That was such a banger. And this is like, you know, oh, okay, I'm like, I guess we're okay. Fucking girt. We don't use the word girt enough. Our, na our national anthem says we're girt by sea. And it's just like, it's just not a word that anyone ever uses. So, like, I'm going to attempt to use the word girt during this live, live stream. Like, oh, you know, this ice, but, you know, we're fucking we're girted. No, we can't even use girted as a word. We need the bleach to be girt by ice. I don't know. Alright. Um, we're just going to start putting... Hopefully the temperature doesn't spike too much, because we'll kill all the bleach if, we, if the temperature spikes. Um, we're going to skip this song. This is the second verse. This is the second verse that no one knows. And no one knows it, because it doesn't use the word girt. You know, like... If you use the word girt every line, people would bother learning it. Um. <laughs> Alright, 11 degrees, we'll add a bit more. With my griddle of justice, I bash the enemy in the head, or I burn them like so. I am pencil head. And I am son of pencil head. We erase crime two generations. Okay, thank you. Alright, things seem to be going okay. Is eight grams enough you reckon? It's one gram per hundred mils of bleach. It's probably enough. Actually we're gonna filter it off anyway, but um what's this reaction use? All we're using that's what I like about this reaction actually. We're using household bleach, uh, reasonably high strength, well somewhere between 8 and 12% I'd say these days. Um, iron oxide, which I made from electrolysis, this is red iron oxide. I'm not sure you can see that, but um, quite good. And potassium hydroxide that we're just using to um, make the solution more basic. Um, we could probably use sodium, we could use sodium hydroxide for sure, but um, I'm just using potassium hydroxide because I can. So that's probably enough iron oxide. Use more, yeah, yeah. Well, it's I just how much does this documentary gods say you should use? I, well, actually, I believe in this scenario, you guys are the documentary gods, right? You can't expect me to know everything. I'm relying on chat to tell me how to buddy mix this chemicals. 
which is just the awful, just an awful decision, honestly. All right, 12. It's spiking a bit, but we might just keep going. Um, snails are cold animal snail. That's not helping my. We control the ratios. Uh, why are we talking about snail eating? That's fine. All right. Um, we'll let that stir a little bit. Um, I suppose actually, you know, I've changed my mind. It doesn't matter how much iron oxide we use because we're going to have to filter anyway. So let's put another two grams in. No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. No, I shouldn't. That's fine. I've got to restrain myself. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully that cools down. Bugs can fuck off. I'm going to put some glad wrap over the top of this. Some plastic wrap. Because otherwise a moth is going to fly in there. I can just see that happening. Um... Yeah, I, it's literally so I can blame it on chat when things don't actually work out. That would, that could be, um, <laughs> Tom, Tom seems to like restraint. So I'm glad you think it's fun. Um, this is fun, I suppose. I should really be more organized. <laughs> at least know what I'm doing. But at least I have clean glassware this video, because last video I didn't even have clean glassware. So I believe that's an improvement. Uh, I'm going to put a little bit more in, and then I suppose we'll have to go on our nitrate run. This is... So, am I meant to be able to guess what country this is based on the national anthem? Because I'm going to be awful at this. Oh. Listen to this. Oh man. Dude, you should send me these guys' whole mixtape. I love it. Hell yeah. It's not a national anthem? Oh. This would be a good national anthem. I just. Just assume a different language means it's a national anthem. That's uh, not a great thing to assume. Alright, Rasputin, um, I'm going to, sorry, I'm going to skip this song and press pause, uh, give me a second, oh hell yeah, um, um, while we wait for that to cool down a little bit, we should go get some nitrate because we're going to have to burn some things later on if we want any ferret that way, ferrate. So, uh, where are we? Here's the light. Here's this. Um, can I show you a small bit on my Insta around 10 seconds? Yeah, Danny, it's just share it around. That's fine. Um, sorry, um, I hope you've enjoyed the content so far, but things are about to get a little spooky. So, um, I hope you're ready. I hope my torch is enough battery. All right, it's got one out of four battery. So, um, we're, we're doing it. Let's go. Alright. Oh, caught in the rose bush. Not that way. Turn the light on. Alright. Now you guys get to watch me get murdered in real time. It's dark. Yeah, we're going on a trip. Here we go. Fuck, and this reminds me of Slender. Remember Slender, the game? Yeah, we're going on the nitrate mine.
Yeah, it's 1 a.m. here. Oh, we're getting murdered. Full moon. No, it's not really full moon. Is it still? Let me know if it freezes by the What are the chances everything is working now? Yes, I'm back. That was dramatic. Um, and also unsuccessful. Um, oh, why did it change accounts? Alright. Um. Um, so it turns out that I can't walk that far without the internet disconnecting. Um, which seems very obvious now that I say it, but at the time I thought it would be fine. It's obviously not, and then my phone died, so um, things weren't great. But the good news is this has cooled down a bit, so we can just add a little bit more nitrate, and then, um, sorry, more hydroxide, and then uh, we should be okay. Yeah, yeah. If I just fucking boil down my piss, it should be alright. That's that'll be the fastest way. It's gone very cloudy here, but should be alright. Should be right. Bag, so it doesn't pull too much water from the air. Alright, so now we should... Yeah. Faceless creatures. I am the faceless creature. Where is my face? Sorry, we're, I'm having to do weird, weird angles because uh, the phone... Oh, now you see all the fucking mess in the back. Can't do that. Alright. 
All right, chat. Um, this is a big moment for you because you get to decide how this chemistry is going to go. So, um, now should I just dump all the iron oxide into this basic bleach and we'll just see how we go? How's that sound? Because how bad could it be? Because if everything cocks up, like we've used no like cost of reagents, like the bleach barely costs is a cost, the iron oxide is you know self produced so it just you know that's really easy and the potassium hydroxide is you know I've got heaps of that so that's fine dissolve it in acid do it slowly yeah but why would okay go slow should I cool it or should I heat it because all the all the um uh, literature I've seen on it they heat it but that seems a little bit counterintuitive um boil yeah all right, well, let's just, we'll get a good shot of this bloody thing happening. Some serious science. Hey, maybe I am a fairy, you don't know that. No judgment. All right, three, two, one. High yields abound. So what we're looking for here is we're looking for a pink or a purple colour. Um, which will be hard to see with this much um, stuff in it, but if I have my light, which I put here. Maybe. Who knows? Fine. Heat it to like, I think I'm going to heat it a little bit once everything is added in. But I think it looks good for the moment, right? Um, what I'm doing is I'm adding iron, hydrox iron oxide to bleach because I'm trying to form high oxidation state iron, which will be a pink or a purple colour. I'll just leave that for the moment. What are we thinking, people? Um, <laughs> One dollar compensation if it's yellow. This is a slight side point, but if it is yellow, there's a chance it is might be yellow, and that's because this was made from steel, and I don't know how much chromium is in the steel. Um, I don't think it... Oh, what was that? I don't think there's going to be that much chromium in the steel, but if there is, the bleach should easily oxidise it to chromate, and then when we add barium later on, we'll precipitate out barium chromate, which is a bright yellow. So there is a small chance that our end product, instead of being a nice pink or purple, will be bright yellow, which would be a real shame and a real fucking... Another, you know, yellow chemistry all the time. All right. Still shouldn't, normal still shouldn't have much. You're, yeah, so hopefully, hopefully it should be okay. That's, that's what I'm relying on. Uh, prepare yourself for the next song. Oh, how can I? Where, where do we go from here? All right. Let's get this heating a bit, just a little bit, because at the moment it's still cold, still only 10 degrees, which I count as cold. Let's uh, let's have a go at just filtering a little bit, see if we get any colour at all. Sorry, I needed some sort of paper.
Oh, what is this? <laughs> impurities aren't impurities if you pretend that they're the product you're aiming for. Yeah. Also, how do you complete a chemistry degree and still be so bad at folding filter papers? What weed trash is this? This song goes well with my inability to fold filter paper. I'm gonna get another beaker. Oh, sorry. <laughs> high, high intensity. Alright, absolutely no colour as of yet. Nothing. So, um, doesn't look like there's any ferrite produced as of yet. That's okay, that's okay. We'll um, see how the heating goes about it. 25% <laughs> weebs? I think it's more than that, surely. It's like 25% not selling it very well but um all right let's hit, let that heat um let's get it cranking um don't say shit like that fucking mark shekelberg talking shit about me get me get me arrested um um, Journal of Yellow Chemistry. No, please. Um, I smash all the utensils using this thing. Um, this is a very confusing way to make TADV. Yeah, but you know, extra effort. You go the extra mile, you get rewarded. You know. Um. We should make chrome, uh, ferrates the other way, because I'm not sure this is going to work. So we should try doing it the, um, the more, um, fire and explosions way of doing it. Fire and explosions? Yeah. <laughs> the only thing terrorists get. Bad yields. Okay. Alright. So, um, while we let that just react away, my thought, I'll pull this out. Much better. 21%. Okay. Doing drugs, you yeah. <laughs> I'll drink this beer again. No, I won't. No, I'm not even going to joke about that. That was disgusting last time. Um, and now it's been open for like a month, just on the bench in the lab, so that's not good. Um, this is iron, and I reckon if we put this in a metal container with a whole lot of potassium nitrate, light it on fire, I reckon we'll make some ferrates that way, and then we can just extract it with water. What could possibly go wrong? Right? Um, please let me know what could go wrong. <laughs> Alright. Um, oh, but that means we need nitrates. I need to go on the nitrate run but I can't take the phone with me because the Wi-Fi doesn't reach that far. So I'm gonna to have to go on the nitrate run by myself um, and you guys get to watch the temperature happen, okay? I'm gonna go get the nitrates. Dragon Force. The reaction exothermic. Um, I think technically yes, but I think it's also very slow when, when using iron oxide. So, um, yeah, I'll get the electricity temperature. So, 
Um, let me know if anything goes really bad. I might take the temperature up. So just you guys get to watch it. Um, you don't actually get to change anything. So if things go wrong, all you get to do is be helpful and watch. But um, I'll be back in uh, about a minute. All right. Good luck, fam. I need a torch. All right, we back. Yeah, yeah, no, time to die. How things go? Ah. All right. Good news. Nitrate mine. That was plentiful. So, what did you miss? Uh, not much. One part of iron filings on iron plate. One, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Something like that. Oh. Um, sorry, where's my tiny bucket of knife back? I should fill that up somehow. Yeah, it's a bit of nitrate. I wasn't really meant to show you guys how much nitrate I have because I feel like that's a, a thing I shouldn't be flexing on. You know, weird flex, but not really okay, kind of thing. Um, because, yeah, like, you know what I mean? Like, like, this this makes me look more terroristy than anything else. Even though that's never my intention, and I only bought it in bulk because it was cheap. I can't even get it open. Oh no. Ah oh, no. Ah oh, fuck me. Yeah. One down. Thing. How do you? Did I just lift that? No. Ah. Why did I do this to myself? Ah. How's the chemistry going, guys? How was How was everyone's Christmas? <laughs> Why are you watch me fucking struggle with this? Ah, oh, come on. Come on, you fucking... Oh, fucking thing!
Did I get it? Is there a technique for opening? Oh. Nah. I was hoping someone would be like, a chat would be lighting up like, the correct way to open a cable tie is to do something or other. Yes! Fuck yeah! That's the only Alright. Big nitrate sack. There goes my spoon. My spoon is fucked. Let's try and pour it out. this with the um, steel wool. I'm not going to really be able to cut up the steel wool, but should that be okay, people think? Because I reckon we'll get at any chance of getting any yield at all. later on. Get a big sack of... Safety. Um, might not work. Well, is there a better way of... Should we find to mix? That's conflicting. Come to Brazil. Um, before we do that, let's check back on our bleach method. Where is it? 34 degrees? The tiny fire extinguisher. Yeah, this is my defense. Is this more weeb trash? Have you put more weeb trash in the playlist? Um, let's have a look. This is weed trash. Weed <laughs> 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 trash. Oh no. Who upvoted this? Alright, um, doesn't look like there's any colour in that bleach, by the way. So, things aren't looking great. What has this stream turned into? I feel like it's more coherent now than it has been before. Um, so, that means we're relying on this other method to be able to have any success at all. So, what do we need? We need a steel container. I will find a steel container. Need the torch.
Yep. What do people think? Add some. Yeah, maybe I could add some hydroxide to it. I'll add a little bit of it. That fly in the glassware. Oh, it better not be. Oh, there's a moth. Oh no. Oh no, poor guy. Oh no. Have a look over there. See, there's a moth and a spider. Um, no, I'm watching it out. Oh no, the moth's gonna get away. Easy. Oh, oh, spider's coming. Oh no, the moth got away. Alright, next time, spider. Um, lamps. Yeah, good on your moth. Um, why is that spider there? I don't know. Beautiful. Alright. Sacrifice him in the beaker, no. This is wholesome, yeah. I believe I believe in this. Alright, stoichiometry out the window, I think. Uh, I think everyone will agree with that. So this Choosing songs is hard. That's why I have to let you choose. That was that was the hardest part of the last video. It was like choosing a song from all the requests. It was like forcing me to be play favoritism with things. What are we thinking? Um, can we play some cameraman songs? Oh no. Oh, people vote for it, I suppose. But it won't be good. Um, what do people think of this nitrate to iron ratio? Oh, I forgot the hydroxide. I think that's a good suggestion. I'll get some sodium hydroxide. Sorry, that's a bad camera angle. It's one to two. Oh, sorry, you've been yelling it to me. Um, yeah, I know. The thing is, the thing that, just the stoichiometry, like, it's great and all, but like, when it, you do it like this, like, surely it doesn't matter. Right? Like, do, you, do, you, do people agree? Like, like, you know what I mean? Like, surely the ratio isn't going to matter when it's like so inhomogeneous. And three pinch. Nitrogranadine. Is that how he's felt? Granadine. Yeah, I, I did I did a bit of stuff. Well, I made granadine nitrate and then I did a little bit of... That's three pinches. That should be good. Um, that's probably a bit too much. Probably four pinches. Um, it, yeah. I mean, like, ideally it should because I would like do it a bit better, but um, I'm just not doing it good, so. This <laughs> is what I'm too afraid to ask. We're trying to make high oxidation state iron. I've said that about 12 times, but if you're new, just thanks for tuning in. 
Ah, string looks broken, but um, yeah. So so one of the ways we're trying to do it was with bleach here. If you've just tuned in. And the other way, we're trying to use um, potassium nitrate, and we're going to light this on fire. Um, this, hypothetically, should be better, but we've taken some shortcuts, and it doesn't look like it's paying off for us. <laughs> Which is all my fault. I could blame chat, but I'm not going to, because I'm a nice guy. Whereas this um, should work better, but I think the yields are going to be awful. Iron isn't real. Yeah, you're right. Um, um, what am I doing? I need to, is this light going to hold out? There's a battery. Battery is awful. But, um, I reckon we might give this a sh possibly. I might be able to cover it just slightly and then maybe, maybe I'll punch a hole in the lid and put a sparkler in. No, I should put a bit. Just put a cycle in there. No, it's that was bad. Um, how should I light it? Oh, it looks broken again. Um, making or getting a furnace? No, I haven't. Um, haven't done either of those things. I, I, I don't, can't run any high temperature stuff. Um, anything above probably. 600 is pushing it. 600 is what my gas burner gets to, and my you know blowtorch probably gets to 800. But you know, yeah. So I can't do anything really above 600. Um, <laughs> one must become to that's if there ain't. Uh, what the what the fuck am I getting? Um, oh, I need. To, do I have a spark plug? That would be really great if I did. Yes, good. Um. Alright, now this is going back to some good old fashioned explosion of fire days with a spark like this. Um, uh, so, now what do we need? Should I just be able to... Yeah, how wrong could that go? <laughs> Very wrong, but it should be all right. Don't think a fuse will work. You don't think it'll be hot enough? Sparkler, Mark, uh, okay, let's see if I got more sparklers, because if it doesn't light, we can just try a different method, I suppose. So, the battery's dying on my light. Um, and sugar might be onto something. Really quick and dirty prep. Um, I think you're onto something there. Let's add a tiny bit of sugar just to help it along. This is real science now. Um, mercury fulminate to ignite it. Thank you, Mercury. But no. Alright, I'll just give that a little bit of a shake so that it kind of stays mostly at the top. All right, what are we thinking guys? Does this look like a real scientific synthesis? No, don't answer that. Um, sugar back. Get ready to publish, yeah definitely. Uh, just to keep the sugar up, yeah, yeah the, sorry. Sugar to keep the temperature up. Yes, yes, yes. So we'll give this a shot, it doesn't light. 
Well, then we've just cocked up. Well, if it doesn't light, it's not too bad, but it doesn't really work, then um, we've kind of ruined two preps for the day. But maybe the real prep was the friends we made along the way. Let's just give this another shot. Still no Carla coming through, which is disappointing. Um, light it. Next song is on Nile. I oh, know. Um, just tune in. All right. Well, I think it's a good time to just tune in because I think I feel like we're going to go light some fires outside. Importantly. Um, all right. So what do I need? I need love. Yes. Blowtorch. Yes, I'm going to pause the playlist so we can listen back on whatever the hell this is. Um, oh no. Uh, we'll, we'll have to listen to this when we get back. Finally some burning. Yeah, I know, I know. I feel ya. Alright. That goes there. That cord doesn't go over the hot plate because that would be very bad. Um, this, we need this, we need this, we need this, and we need this. And now we go outside. Except this time towards the Wi Fi router, not away from it. Alright, turn on the light. This is some vintage explosions and fire shit here. See comments when I'm out here. All right. Just see that it's all working fine. It probably looks like it's cut out because I'm like walking around, but hopefully it should be all fine. I don't want it to cut out because if it cuts out, then um, I have no film of this. And it'll probably be amazing and no one would ever know. Why can't I see comments on my phone here? Oh, there it is. Oops. How are we? Is it so... Everyone, let me know if the stream is working fine. Now we hope the stream just doesn't drop out.
Good. I don't want to approach it. <laughs> See, now this is the worst part of it. When something doesn't work, then you don't want to approach it. Oh man, that's going to take so long to do. Alright, so, nothing. Oh, it went out. Alright, uh, I'm just going to grab some more sparklers and try again. Let's do it. Come on. All right. Let's try it again. Burn it. It's glowing. Yes. Rise. Rise. Yes. 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 You beautiful thing. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Oh, feels good. Feels good. Feels good. All right. Now, into the belly of the beast here. Looking burnt, I suppose. I have no idea if it's burnt all the way through. I suppose I could give it the oldie blowtorch. Um, don't try this at home. That's enough, that's enough. Got to stop myself. Um, maybe we'll let it cool down a little bit. Let's go back inside. Um, and uh, yeah, let's see what chat thought of that. <laughs> Hopefully it drop out.
No rubber gloves over flames. Good point. Forgot about the gloves. Thank you. Um, I, I'm not sure this is the appropriate music here. I'm sure use my one skipping power for the day and skip that. Um, Uh, yes, good. So fireworks. Um, so people think that. Oh. I'm, I'm a loss for words with these these songs. Um. And let's check the ferrite here, this one. So people reckon that I should do a, um, a, um, uh, what am I trying to say? Use a potassium hydroxide solution to extract what was in the can, you reckon? <laughs> you got through a whole minute of it, all right? Um, <laughs> this is a Christian server, alright? Um, let's go, I'm going to bring in the, um, the can, hopefully it's cooled down a little bit, and we'll, we'll have a look. Got some water here, let's move my succilic extractor. How was that, by the way? Succilic. Perfect. Flawless! Right, still a little toasty, but um, hmm, might be okay. What is this? Once again, police are coming now. Drink the beer. All right, did I melt the table? Okay. Um, interesting. How hot are we? Fairly hot. I'm trying not to melt my gloves. Still pretty hot. So we'll give that just another two minutes. Should cool down. And we turn our attention back to this. What are we going to do about it? It doesn't look like it's working in the slightest here. Which is a disappointment. Um. Drink the reaction mix, yeah. Don't think it's going to be any current. Give me your strongest potion. Um, work up the ferrite. Well, hopefully we can uh, turn it into barium ferrate, and then that should um, give us reasonable purity, I suppose. And that's that's a lot more stable. And you can still use barium ferrate as an oxidizing agent, um, just so um, it doesn't matter too much that it's insoluble. I mean, it does, but it should be okay. For sulfate to it. Um oh, now we've changed one down. Uh Alright, Arabic music, let's not let's not get too stereotypical here. Um alright, let's just let's try and extract this now. We've got this here. 
Where are we? Not too warm. Should just be out of Edson. Alright, might be a little warm. Should really wait till that cools down. Alright, it's nowhere near cool. <laughs> It's very hot. Um, hey, sure, sure, yeah. Hmm. All right. I didn't expect this to go so badly. Oh, I mean, okay. Look, I lied. I expected this to go quite badly, but not as badly as this, which was absolutely nothing. Um. I suppose what I could do is I could, because I could add some acid to this, I'll get a new container of bleach out, right, add, dissolve this up in acid and then add it to the, um, the, you know what I mean? Do we just quit while, just give up on this for the moment? I think so. Or are we, we're two hours in, all right. Um, Iron oxide, yeah, it's just not soluble enough. Alright, we'll let that cool down. Um, I think we'll give up on that. This is very hot still. We want to cool this down a bit. Right, so we'll leave this beaker for the um, another attempt here, and I uh, will. Yeah, I got to filter off the carbon for sure. Yeah, we'll get these things out of the way. very unreacted at the bottom. Yeah, look at that, it's just... This music does not convey my sadness enough. How did that all survive? Ah... Uh, oh well. Knew it wouldn't work. Oh, thanks. We had to try, I suppose. Well, I mean, we didn't have to try, but... See how we go with it. I guess it's 
the tuner set up amp. Alright, on there, I need to get the uh, top tuner thing. is soluble, as I was questioning earlier, but it seems okay. Um, that there, that there, check the pump on. Apologies for the noise. I don't think this is going to filter very well. I'm going to put some filter paper down. Just turn the pump off for the moment. Uh, filter paper. circle like just roughly the size of this thing. Perfect circle. Perfect circle. Let's try a little bit better. That's the perfect circle. Oh man. more than three seconds. Holy shit, I might have actually got it back up and running. Holy shit, it's actually alive. Wow. That took far too long. I'm out here. This is the, uh, I know it's dark, but um, this is the side of my house, and those lights there are the Wi-Fi router. So here, this is, a, this is the Ethernet cord that runs along the side of my house. It's 30 meters of ethernet cord. Oh, the ethernet port over there. It's my cat in the darkness that we can't see. So, um, thanks. 
Chan, not the four. All right. Uh, I think we might have to quit while we're ahead here. Sorry, you don't want to look at my ugly fucking face. There we go. We get to look at the failed chemistry. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm tired of this internet shit. Um, look, we're back. We're back. Can we listen to bitch lasagna, or is that too much to ask on my internet? Progress. No, actually, because I've spent the last ages just fucking around with my internet. Um, what is this? <laughs> the only possible chance we have here is that we might be able to check our iron solution and see some ferrite, and that would make my day. So, make my day. Nothing. There's some lovely crystals in there, but I think they're just possibly potassium chloride. It's not going to focus on it, is it? That's the thing, it either takes forever or it doesn't work at all. So, um, we're probably going to have to make iron hydroxide and then add it to the bleach later on, I think. What do you think about it? Why this didn't work, but maybe, I think the iron hydroxide is just so, I'm going to crank the heat up, but um, I think it's just so insoluble that it just doesn't react at all because it just can't um, do it. Either that or my hypochlorite concentration is very low, but even then if it's low, it should just work, but just not to a good extent. But we're seeing it really not work at all. 
Well, no, nah, because I mean that's not even barely pink. There's there's nothing in that at all. I mean that's just so. Oh, it could be chlorate crystals as well. Oh no, it's oh no potassium. We even put potassium in there, so it's probably potassium, potassium chlorate. Yeah, iron hydroxide works. Yeah. Well, something something experiment. You know, we tried. It would have been cool if it worked. Because it would have been a bit easy because iron oxide is easy to make and cheap, real cheap to buy. So, yeah. Refresh this page. And that is fucking yellow. Look how yellow that is. Absolutely horrific. Nice plastic nitrate crystals down the bottom. So yellow. So bloody yellow. Um. What is this? Oops, sorry. Yeah, someone owes me money for that. Sorry, I can't. I'm just back around with the microphone. This is a mess, you're right. Um, I'm, I'm here in front of the camera with some inspirational. <laughs> um, what do we do now? They both failed for good reason too, I think. No, I don't have any iron trichloride. Iron nitrate I assume would work fine too. But um, how does it sound okay? <laughs> <laughs> or is it ASMR a request? Um, don't feel bad for you. Know, don't, don't give it your pity, pity money. Oh no. Um, at least I don't have to dab for that money. I, yeah, so I suppose I should uh, make. Um, you can make epic solution five minutes of soluble iron. I wonder if I have any, I, I checked if I had any soluble iron, but surely, isn't there a prep where you can just melt? Yeah, I, we kind of tried that and it didn't work too well. Well, that's because I stuffed it up, to be fair. Um, because I didn't mix the things, it didn't light very well. So, that's a thing. But, um, what if we have any soluble iron? Yeah, I, uh, I could add HCl to that and then I suppose. Let's do it. Yeah, in fact, well, I mean, I was going to maybe call it a day, but let's, let's do it. Got a couple minutes. Let's do it. Let's, let's race through this. How hard could it be? All right, what do we need? Uh, nitric or HCL? Nitric. Now it's time for the pretty little lady to come forth with a real pretty song. Let's call her an outfit. Let's make it up to Billy Allen. Yes, let's do it. Uh, don't fume too much, please. Yeah, 
no. Alright, so there, on there, alright, this is fucked, so we'll move this to the side. That's cool. Uh, we'll turn it off the moment. Try not to spray so much bleach solution everywhere. That, 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 that. Um, and base by before adding to bleach, yeah, yeah, probably you should do that. Yeah, you're right. Should it be dissolving better than that? I'll give it a bit of heat. Don't crack. Don't crack the glass. Um, yeah, what am I? Should dissolve, right? It should be. It should be good concentrated. Nitric and bring out the big guns. Let's fucking don't have time for this. Red fuming. Let's do it. Take off the nitrile gloves. That's always important. Glasses on. Oh, that's pressurized. Let's. Iron oh, oxide isn't being very uh, reactive, is it? <laughs> Oh, it is dissolving a little. Hey, just... A little bit of heat. Doesn't fume too much, catch crazy. And um, there's definitely magnetic iron still in there because See, it's kind of stirring a little, but um, there's no stir bar in there. Got a self self stirring solution. Oh, bleach! More bleach! More bleach! Just set fire to all my iron wool. Um, Oh, I 
fucking munch at this sort of paper. Let's just do that. It is dissolving, it's just very slow for no particular reason. Alright, this, this, this. Down there, down there. Um, beaker. It is heating slightly. This is a jam, for sure.
the drop side. Oh, are we? Bang it. Alright, I think we'll be back. Uh, that one, I cannot blame on the, uh, the, um, the internet. That was my phone died. I wasn't keeping track of the battery and it drains pretty quick when uh, we're doing the stream. It's back. All right, shall we do it? Let's add some bloody soluble iron to our bleach. Let's just check how good quality the study stream is. All right, it's all right. I want some pink. Now it looks exactly the same as the other <laughs> reaction. It didn't work at all. Interestingly, this other reaction here. Um, I have to get the light right. Do you see it's slightly bubbling? It's just bubbling away. It's not boiling. But it's giving off some kind of gas there. So I don't know what it is. Don't kill it. Yeah. All right, do you reckon it'll work? Let's, uh, shit. Angry bleach noises. Not quite any colour yet. <laughs> a pixel of purple, yes! I would just... Ah, uh, if this was an edited video, I could just Photoshop it in. Um, but, um... Re... 
Ray. Yeah, it's basically how I'm feeling. I mean, it looks like it's changing color. No. Yeah, they're big pixels. They are big pixels at the moment. Mm. All right, people. I don't think this scissors just wants to work tonight. The last stream, the chemistry worked so well, it got me overconfident, thinking that I might actually be able to have success, you know, without trying too hard. But it turns out that we might actually need to put some thought and effort into this <laughs> strategy to get it to work. Which is, you know, heartbreaking. Let's just check this other solution. Yeah, I don't know. It's not, it looks alright. Like that nearly looks purple. Like that nearly looks okay. But then when you filter it, it doesn't. It's close. Well, maybe not. Maybe it's just. I mean, what is... Pixels are huge. Why? <laughs> Maybe if I... <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm going to let these things run overnight. Maybe we'll come back to heaps of ferrite in the morning. But it's definitely, oh, I think it's looking slightly pink. Like that, that's not too bad, right? I think that's good. You would say that's purple? How big are the pixels? Yeah. All I want is purple. Yep, good enough. Look, someone said it's purple. It's so dilute. It's probably dispersed iron oxide. But you know what? At this point, we'll take the win. We'll just say, yep, hey, look, we made it. I said I'd demonstrate high oxidation state iron. 
I did it. <laughs> what I'm going to do is really, I think the thing to do is just to leave these solutions overnight because it is looking like they get better with time. I'll give this one one more filter. And uh, who knows. But um, I might have to wrap up this stream. It's definitely been good fun. I like this power cord just going through the middle of my setup here. Like, Oh, that's purple. Is it? Oh, holy. Holy moly. Oh, maybe it's a hole in the filter paper, is it? What's this? What's this? Must be a hole in my filter paper. Yeah, it is. Okay. It's fine. I got excited for like... Ooh, yeah. Um... Oh, wow. Um... Yes. Let's... Call this... This is purple here. I mean, you can't... You can't fight me on this. That's purple. So, um... We'll, uh... Call this a day, I reckon. Um, because the pixels are... Oh, actually, they're small enough. Good enough, yes, thank you. Yeah, that's basically what I'm getting at. Um, I'm proud of me. I mean, I'm proud of me. And that's the most important thing, right? That's too low. Um, yeah, shit. I got a beer to drink at the end of this stream. Um, yes. Fuck. No, I'm tired. Let's... Ah, oh, I don't know how to do this. Yep, okay, um, I'll see you next stream. Hopefully there should be another extra Extraction to Die video. Oh, maybe not so soon. But hopefully I'll get the oxygen cylinder running through the ozone later. Lab tour. Oh, maybe I'll we'll run a lab tour. Maybe I'll run a lab tour when it's light. You know, it's a bit hard when it's dark. More organic chem. Yeah, organic chem just doesn't seem to work for me. You know what I mean? Like, it just... Yeah. Anyway, hopefully, there, there should be a new Explosions in 5 video sort of soon. I've got to do a little bit of work for it, but um, it should, um, should be out reasonably soon. So, um, it's organic chem. Of course, it doesn't work. Yeah, basically. <sighs> yeah. I think, I think the, the split between metal chemistry and, um, yeah... All right, anyway, people are saying goodbye, so I'll say goodbye too. Thanks for tuning in, and um, good night, and um, I'll see you guys. Yeah, we'll run this stream again. This was good fun. Chem student. It did work. We got some purple, so <laughs> it's fine. So, yep. Thanks for tuning in once again, um, and sticking with me through all the technical difficulties. I know it's a bit boring when uh, things tune out, so... Yep. Well, I do have a Discord. Join the Discord. Um, someone post a link in the... Actually, I'll post a link. Just hold on a sec. It'll be in the comment section of this video. There'll be a Discord link to join the server. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye. I can stare, stare at the purple one more time as I work out how to actually disconnect the video. I'm at 6 p.m. here. All right. What's the time? 3.11. Oh, man. And the cricket starts again at 9.30. It's almost six hours until the cricket starts. Shit. Bye.